Hey what's up guys, today another support video and we're gonna look at the controller sign in option. So first of all if you want to set it you can go to settings, you can go to sign in security and passkey and when at this screen you can see instant sign in. So instant login logs in the same person every time you boot up the console. The problem with this is of course if you have several people using the console. When this is the case it's beneficial to use the controller sign in option. What this does basically is instead of an instant login so instantly the same person like you can set it to one person like for example me running galaxy sign me in every time you turn on the console but instead of doing that you can say let the controller decide who signs in when I turn on the console. This controller, this very controller I'm using right now, as you can see says um, signs in burning galaxy. If I grab another one of my controllers, let me turn it on for a second. We go to sign in as security and it says this controller signs in Suki, which is the account of my sister. Um, so yeah, as you can see this makes it really, really convenient and easy to switch between people. So if you, if, if my sister wanted to play on Xbox, she could simply turn on this controller and it would sign her in. She see it here, she's signed in. Didn't have to do any other settings. So let me show this when the console is turned off, how that, if it, that it really works the way you want it to. And here we see it. My sister's logged in. I'm not logged in at all. So I can play on PC or whatever and do whatever I want so without disturbing that console. If you had instant login on my name, I would have been logged in as well. So I would have been um, logged in and I would have been really, really annoying because she would have to log me out um, if I wanted to, to play on my PC or something that would interrupt her screen. Like that I started uh, playing Gears on PC, for example, and she's playing Gears of War on the console. She would have gotten a message on screen saying like you can't be signed in uh, twice with the same account at the same time of course. So that would have interrupted her game which is annoying of course. So if I turn the console off again, turn off the console. And press start up with the other controller, with my controller. And on uh, modes, I'm currently on energy saving, which is why it takes so long to turn the console on. And as you can see, I'm logged in. My sister ain't, so we're all good to go. No problems there. Really, really useful. Um, and something to keep in mind if you got like a family who plays on the same console, but you don't want to go through all these steps to log in uh, with passwords and stuff like that. I hope this helped clarify the difference between instant login and controller sign in and what they both should be used for. If this video helped you be sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe and hopefully I'll see you guys next time.